We are stopped at a NATO checkpoint where they are refusing to let anyone through, even unarmed persons. The NATO soldiers are very tense under their regime-like control as they nervously scan the horizon. They've spotted a small element of citizens along the wood line and immediately opened fire. Hey, does anybody want to write this down? I'm going to name off what they look like so when we go to town we can watch for them. Ever suspicious of any civilian that comes within eyesight of the NATO stronghold, soldiers take note of the suspicious civilians. Two of those, hey, two of those guys were the, uh, the, uh, um, the Gulf Force guys. Inside the NATO base, life continues at a mundane pace. Hey, where the fuck's Tom? He's inside. Hey, he's still upstairs. Okay, well, he, Aaron said to go tell him to go sit in the fucking car. The incoming police vehicle carries the mayor, making efforts to ally NATO with the citizens. So we were going to come down to deliver an official message, but we also had a humanitarian assistance we wanted to provide, of course, on behalf of the NATO coalition. Okay. We'd be willing to accept it. Uh, we're about to send up a troop platoon down to come to link up with you all, but we can okay. drop off the humanitarian assistance when we come down there. That's perfect. And if I escort you, it's going to be easier on the public. You said in the, the, the people that uh, Resting. We invite them to uh, yeah. come enjoy the fine city. We have casinos. We have various casinos. We have various bars, various restaurants, nightclubs, karaoke barring. Right here. Yeah. Let's do this at uh, let's say seventeen hundred. I'm going to come down with a platoon. Okay. Now let's meet at the police station. We can have a better discussion about where that sounds to clear good. The air. I, I, and we're sending some folks to come take leave. We'll see how to proceed with that. Great In the meantime, uh, I do not know if your men have had uh, economic. Injections we have not. So it's very important that your men spend money in town. Yes. Obviously, U.S. dollars is the preferred currency, but yeah. I understand that uh, part of it is uh, important. So I understand you have approximately 100 men. Thank you very much. So we'll make sure that our guys uh, spend some money in town. It's very important that they do. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Have a good day. Be safe travels. Thank you. We'll see you at 17. You get approved yet? Mission completed. The mayor returns to his escorts to return to the city of Grozny and his citizens. Josh Warren rolls through. Yeah, I think. Are we taking a dude? Do I let No, do not let him through. I was like, they can do it. Plainclothes NATO soldiers are spotted nearby. Hatching the plan. Yeah, let that do the I talked to Alex and said we weren't expecting that. They're going to be on guard. An incredulous NATO commander approaches the mayoral brigade. 
Satisfied, he motions to his fellow commander and slinks away. Foreign movement within the NATO base is nearly impossible, as soldiers cower in fear of a surprise attack, questioning every move. You guys moving all together? Yes, sir. All right, hold on. Give another 500. Yeah. And then that way you guys can break up the fight. All right, you guys don't make sure you check out with so you know that. Inside the NATO Command Center, leadership plans their battalion troop movement into Grozny. I can't say exactly what we're looking for, but it looks like we'll have it. The hearts and minds, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> You're gonna win hearts and minds? Hearts and minds. That's hearts and minds. minds. That's the ones that's protected by a cover. <laughs> 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 NATO movement is underway as a battalion loads up in trucks and heads down the road to Grozny. About a kilometer from Grozny, the convoy stops to drop off a group of undercover soldiers. We can only guess what this covert move may mean for the citizens and the government of Grozny. convoy stops to drop off the uniformed soldiers for their march into town. Back in the city, we learn that the mayor has been taken hostage by a rogue group of imposters. Who captured the mayor? ISIS did. What? Yes. I thought you were a good person. Well, I'm not. I'm a uh, Muslim memes. <laughs> ISIS are the other guys, the security group. ISIS captured mm -hmm. the president? The mayor. The mayor, I mean, yes, mayor president. Yes, the mayor was up there. I was up there talking to some of them. And the mayor and his security were in a room. And what happened was they suddenly threw grenades. And they threw like three of them and they kept throwing and they blew everybody up. Oh no. They went in and they only healed the, the, the mayor and they put him in the room and announced to everybody that the mayor was captured. Oh, it was high escalation, ex escalation of violence like never be seen before in Grozny. But you're not associated with them? Uh, I'm not directly associated with them, no. Okay, okay. But I was there when it happened. I saw him <laughs> blow up. I love a quote. We do not want to harm a single hair. Grab me the lawyer. I got the mayor here. He's safe right now. Okay. I want to negotiate. Bring up a lawyer. No more curfew. 
I will stay up late. I will eat ice cream for dinner. No, you won't. Curfew is unfair. You are not my real dad. I'm going in, boys. Don't shoot me when you get in there. Once on top of the building, we learn that the mayor has been taken captive by a civilian group of Russian sympathizers. The long building. They're right there. See their heads? Ah! The courthouse is shooting at us. The fool! Do someone on your own! Hey, courthouse is on the ground! Shoot me or I'll die! Have you been. Heal him? Yes. is under control, the Grozny police detain the Russian sympathizers, confiscating their weapons and ammunition. I'm sorry, boys and blues, that we had to do that. I'm so sorry. You know, I have much respect for the boys in blue. What's up? Back to the hell with that. Come on, boy. Hey, Simba. Hey, take uh, take your, take your gun off. Take his gun. Are they all checked? Can you go go across and pat him down one more time? Not all of them are shot. Okay. Hey, we got NATO coming down the street. Uh, oh, jeez. Oh, you kidding me? The arrival of NATO troops in the town could not come at a worse time, as it is sure to throw fire onto an already volatile situation. Hey, take all these guys' bags of ammo. Take all our ammo. Police make an effort to maintain business as usual. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about this, okay? Roger that! Give me 
Hey, first, first squad. squad. First squad. First squad. <laughs> Finally! Uh, the boys in the green speckled uh, come steam game will finally come to show up, eh? Captors are handed off to a private security force to be escorted to the jail and processed. As soon as the sympathizers are gone, trouble brews for the golf club. I am a humble golfer. Why am I here? here to deliver winnings to our oh, geez, Rick, uh, he, I just got the teardrop tattoo for this tournament. He's just golf man. I have money. 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 And then you guys come here, why am I stuck here? Yeah. See, he doesn't understand. We'll call it very cool. Bring everyone to the table. We won't call it everybody. We won't call it Red Violence. We won't call it the 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 Red Violence. The golf club is decimated by police on the suspicion that they are associated with the kidnapping of the mayor. Go in peace, cousin. Thank you. Oh, Murphy. Oh, thank God. Go in peace. You know what that means. Why am I trying I will come for you. They, they honestly will, they should be okay. They're actually counting. Right here. Stop it. 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 Stop it.